welcome to part 21 we will look at some more questions the previous parts are when the members group cloud kernel or cloud ninja members can access it so which service should you use to extract text and key value pairs and table data automatically from scan documents see through common sense we know custom vision is not helpful in this scenario it is like you have a cctv footage and you want to know if there is a fire breakout so that is where you use custom vision and even face recognition here there is no face we only have text table data it's only data no face and no language nobody is telling us to tell from the scan document which language is it written in that is not the case so form recognizer is our answer this service will help you it is also called ai document intelligence now so it applies advanced machine learning how does it do it using machine learning and what does it do it extracts text key value pairs tables and structures from documents automatically and accurately accuracy is important and these are some features it has built in security so that means privacy is also built in and you can do simple text extraction this is one example where you have documents and you do form recognition for process automation knowledge mining and any industry specific applications so it scans such documents uh, like for it's a form kind of thing and you can select what layers you want you want you see this you want just text you want table so this one is a table okay queen street hoken this is a table this is an example of key value pair this is the key for the quarterly period and value is 31st march let's say in this case you have statement of work so you are just picking text like wherever you see contacts you want to document or extract those contacts so once you extract it what do you do you prepare label train analyze so we saw how form recognizer is helpful for extracting text key value pairs table data and structures by the way there are previous parts put for members cloud kernel and cloud ninja members can access those questions it is important to access those to clear your certification so which computer vision feature can you can you use to generate automatic captions for digital photographs suppose you have a photograph and then you say okay this is a photograph uh, of a happy child or a child playing with toys you want to put that kind of automatic caption so vision is uh, it's all called azure ai vision and it is a computer vision for images and video analysis with ocr and ai so we have nothing to do with text or any areas of interest is also text or detecting objects we are specifically focused on images we are talking about images here who told us because digital photographs are images and not just objects so you have this next one you have to match so you have to match what you have to match the facial recognition tasks to this question so you have to uh, do two images of a face belong to the same person you want to check that you know in google photos 
many times it asks for feedback hey this and this is it the same person they will show you two photographs and tell you is it the same person because it is having a challenge to understand for example you have a photograph which is of your childhood so the ai gets confused and it tries to double check with you and say this and this are these the same guy when in, it is trying to double check that means it is trying to do a verification now does this person look like other people so for example uh, there can be a one guy tom cruise and maybe looking like someone else also there may be similar features so that means you are trying to do for a similarity search you are looking for a similar feature similarity search and then when we say okay who is this person in the group of people like G google photos tells you hey this is a group photograph i know these two guys this guy is x this guy is y it specifically asks you who is this guy that means it's trying to identify who is this person once you say hey this is john then it will remember okay this guy is john any photographs of his past present will be marked as john so this would be our final answer i hope you understood and there are previous parts uploaded for members cloud kernel cloud ninja members pay a small premium become a member and gain access to those questions which will help you clear certifications okay a lot of concepts explained there as well so if you are not yet subscribed do so it will help you with clearing certifications and this channel is totally about cloud certification so this brings us to the end of part 21 i hope you understood the concepts and do read the comments i am posting many more parts in the members area and i uh, create short small posts there you can also you know read that so that you get notified when we post such contents